Well, here's my Crash DGI Inspire. As you can see, I broke the uh, the carbon fiber tube here for the uh, support for the um, prop. Um, so what I did <coughs> was I used a uh, three-quarter inch pipe, wrapped it with uh, plastic, and I made with with carbon fiber. You know, I, I made a little tube with a slot in it. Um, so the slot is actually going to go slide into the uh, tube here. Um, it's a perfect fit and uh, that way I can get the tube in here, support the, uh, the carbon fiber that broke and don't have to disassemble any further um, because I heard that it is a nightmare uh, trying to disassemble the motor and the sensors and the LED lights here. Um, so that's where I'm at. I, I have my carbon fiber tube that I built. I trimmed it with scissors after it was um, um, set, but not hard yet, and it uh, came out pretty well. So um, I'm about to slide this baby in. Um, I'm going to slide it in, you know, halfway with the, the five minute epoxy, and then I'll put the, uh, once this is in, I'll uh, put the other part in and slide it in. Um, I also built some little adapter here to, to make sure that everything is straight. I'm going to actually put this on to um, this secures it to make sure that the, uh, the alignment is correct. This, this is going to be perfectly aligned and I also need to deal with the, the tilt here. Um, so that's it. I'll carry on next. Okay, well I just uh, put the, uh, the little extension tube inside. Um, this is uh, the, the one I made. Um, so it's, it's in about this far um, with the slot that allows the wires to still come through. Um, hopefully it gives it enough support. Um, I only wanted to do half at a time to make sure that this was set before I put the final um, put this part and slide this piece in. Um, I had to really make sure this was clean because obviously this is where this is going to um, fit right in and any little epoxy in there is gonna bind it up. So, but it's looking good. I'm, uh, I'm pleased. I think it's gonna work just fine. And uh, until this... And there's the finished product. Uh, came out really well. It's not ideal. Um, you can still see the crack right here, but you know the inside the tube is covering that, so it's going to be support on there. Um, I might put another layer of carbon fiber over it. And the real damage is on this side. Not sure if you can see that, but um, it came out really well. Um, you know when I. When I actually glued it and let the uh, the epoxy set, I made sure that you know thing these were aligned at the proper angle. Um, but that's it. So I'm going to go ahead and power it up and see how it goes. Okay. So we are ready to give it a go. Everything looks good. Got the camera on. Good. Okay, here's the first test flight after replacing the uh, carbon fiber. Yeah, let's see if it does an auto pick up. Thumbs up, baby! Looking good! I'm not going to find a lot of them. So, 
looking good. Repair was successful. Thanks for watching.